We're on strike here for pay and conditions for staff and also to defend against the casualisation of staff at the university. The NTU is on strike. We're on strike for 48 hours. Today is morning two. We've had a lot of people attend and be on the picket line. Respect the picket! Defend workers' rights! For the most part we've been turning cars around and uh, turning people around who were intending to come into the university. Good numbers this morning, probably uh, stronger numbers than this time yesterday. This is what the dispute's about, yeah, like, I know what it's about. People know that management wants to try and shut the pickets down and management wants a stronger police presence here so there's a stronger picketing presence and uh, this follows a really successful day yesterday. We can't break this picket, no. <laughs> we can't break so, this yeah, yeah, no. yeah, get down around. Yeah. I'm a fixed term academic and I'm here to support other fixed term academics and casuals in pushing for continuity of employment and security of employment. I'm a student who supports the staff strikes because they deserve fair wages and this is an ongoing trend across Australia and the world that needs to be stopped. I'm here as a student in solidarity with the cause for the strike. I'm here to defend the staff for their rights but also for students for our education. We're sick of course cuts and we're sick of oversized lectures. The university's on strike today. Undermining working conditions really does undermine education and the quality of education we get here. I'm basically here to support my co-workers and I believe that time should be taken to negotiate with the staff that has served you well for many years. We've been trying to get an enterprise agreement with the bosses at this university since <coughs> August the 7th. That's last year, that's when we logged. They have been playing defer, delay. They want Tony Abbott in so that they can run unions off the campus. We're not going to let them. Angus, rise again, rise again, stand up and fight. To be proud in a union, it is your birthright. What management's offered us is a real pay cut below the rate of inflation. They stalled for seven months and then they came at us with an enterprise agreement which removed any mention of the union in the enterprise agreement, got rid of anti-discrimination provisions, got rid of rights of appeal and review and reduced sick pace. No one in, no one out, shut the union down! One of the clauses they don't want in the agreement is an anti-bullying clause. That's because that's what they are. This is a real struggle, not just for workers at this university, but for workers across Australia. And it, it clearly anticipates what we can expect if an Abbott governs elected later in the year. Our claims are job security, our claims are around career development for general staff, our claims are around supporting casuals. At the moment, there is about 50% of teaching done by academic casuals. That doesn't reflect well on the institution, it doesn't reflect well on university education, and of course, it's crap for the people who have to do that. Which one's got his key? No one in, no one out, shut the union down! Which one's got his key? No one in, no one out, shut the union down! In the job that I do as a casual tutor, the marking, the replying to emails, the preparation for tutorial work very often exceeds the amount of hours that you're officially paid for. There's always going to be some degree of casual work at a university. We want to give, for example, PhD students the opportunity to get some tutoring experience and that kind of thing. But the problem becomes when you've got that situation where people are actually continually being offered casual contracts from one semester to the next for work that is clearly ongoing. It's just a permanent condition of insecurity. There's no real pathways out of that form of work. What happens when you try to cross the picket line? The NTU will keep this fight going. Do you want an action shot? We have been very pleased with the response and the lively response from our membership. We've also been very pleased we've been growing. Yesterday I met picket people on the picket line who joined on the day. Fortunately the union here is strong enough that we're, we're taking a stand against it and I think the importance of actually fighting for permanency for all staff to get things like sick leave, just basic, basic working conditions. The University of Sydney is on strike today! And to have the ability of the union to collectively represent us is fundamental. Thank you.